try to get the clunk so you can hear what I'm talking about. Almost has the sound of like a bad strut. And here's how you go about taking it off. You just push up there. That comes off. Just slide this out, turn, and pull off. Then to go put the new one on, you can adjust this forward a little bit. And then you put it together in reverse order. Rebecca B9, OEM bushing, polyurethane bushing. You can see the difference here. I was getting clonking from the front end. It seemed to come from both sides. This would be the kit I used for it. In order to do that, you need a 12 millimeter and you have a 12 millimeter nut there and a 12 millimeter bolt there and to get everything off you take these two bolts out you pull off the outer brace then you can slide the uh, sway bar forward a little bit and then there's a slit that you just spin it around and pull straight down and then make sure you grease everything back up and clean the area. And you can put it all back together and make sure all the alignment marks match up with the OEM one. Since the new ones are adjustable, I just put them side by side and match the holes up and made sure everything stayed where it was when I tightened it down. But after you get the bolts out, you take that off and there's the slit there. You just turn to the side and pull down. And that's all you gotta do to replace your sway bar bushings.